Question 92. The fluoride ion of calcium fluoride is a weak base. It is the conjugate base of the weak acid hydrofluoric acid. As a result, calcium fluoride is more soluble in. So let's just assume for a second that calcium that our solution sorry is a more acidic solution that we've increased the amount of hydrogen ions so we've got our two equations up here dissociation of calcium fluoride creation of um, a hydrofluoric acid from its uh, individual ions so what happens if we increase the amount of hydrogen well if we increase the amount of hydrogen we're going to drive this equation more towards the right so we're going to get increased amount of hydrofluoric acid and therefore we're going to consume more of this uh, fluoride ion so therefore our overall concentration of fluoride ion is going to go down in solution. So if our concentration of fluoride ion has gone down here, our uh, equation since it's working towards equilibrium is going to be right shifted i.e. we're going to have um, more, more dissociation of our calcium fluoride so we're going to get less calcium fluoride um, in order to compensate for the decrease in um, fluoride fluoride sorry therefore since our concentration of calcium fluoride has gone down um, our and ie we're going to dissociate our calcium fluoride more we're going to have a more soluble calcium fluoride in acidic solution than in any other solution so um, and therefore, the correct answer for question 92 is a, a more acidic solution will result in um, increased dissociation slash solubility of calcium fluoride. Question 93. So we know that our KSP is equal to our, the concentration of our calcium times the concentration of our fluoride squared. So therefore, the higher the KSP, the more products are produced in an equilibrium, i.e. the higher the KSP, the more calcium and fluoride ions we're producing. So therefore, the higher the KSP, the more right side of the equilibrium is, the more the equilibrium prefers to produce those right-sided products. Now, in this specific equation, uh, equilibrium, the calcium fluoride dissociation equilibrium, on the right side, our ions, calcium and fluoride, are aqueous. So therefore, since the more the higher the KSP, the more right side of the equilibrium, the higher the KSP, the more we prefer that to produce aqueous ions versus our solid precipitate. So the higher the KSP, the less likely we are to um, form this solid precipitate. So therefore, the higher the KSP, the more um, sodium fluoride we need to add to see precipitation. So if we just go through our list, we have um, barium fluoride has the highest KSP, so therefore it is going to be the slowest to precipitate. And similarly, um, strontium fluoride has the lowest KSP, so it's going to therefore be the first to precipitate. Therefore, the correct answer is C for question 93.